Hello and welcome back to Bard's Tale 4. Nope. Hey. Um, can we loot him from here? No. Ah, okay, I see. Who is it? You. Well, let's give you more strength. How can I help? Mm. Levitate. I don't really care for levitate. Archmage. Deal plus one damage for each spell point you possess when attacking with spells. Ooh. Mm. That's a lot of spells. Um. Oh, I can. I could only choose one of those. Interesting. Gain plus one spell point at the end of each turn, or gain twice as many spell points for meditate. I think I would rather go for this one. Yeah. And you learn to brew. Wait, where could I put you? Ah, I see. Okay. Was that four exactly? Well, nothing apparently. Come on. Thank you. Let's eat. <laughs> let's see. And let's hide. Because we are going straight for them. Away I go. Speak. I don't know why, but there's it's something is wrong with the choosing of space. See, I cannot choose. Um, maybe it's his model. On your word. 
here. Orders? Yeah. At your command. Yes? Yes? Go! Moin! Yep. Here. On your word. Oh. Speak. Sure. Bottoms up. That drink will be your last. Now we're talking. Speak. What do you mean to hit something for the target? That worked. That worked. Why won't this work? I don't understand that one. There's really something really wrong. Because as you can see, there it's just not possible for me to speak. I will not be insulted. I have no idea why. But we made it. And to be honest, that's all that matters. Oh, and we leveled up. Quick reflex is 10% increased critical chance with shields. Mm. Smite. And remove all courses. Eh. Heal hmm. plus frequency each time you deal damage. 
That's always nice. Sweet. No. I'm really intrigued by the different locations that we visit. Now, each dungeon is really different here. And I appreciate it. Okay, that's the beginning. Time has been kind to this place. And which one of you brought Quarrel with you? It's blocked. Okay, we definitely should be over there. Okay, give me a minute. I'll go again and see, look for what we might have missed. So, be right back. Okay, obviously we need to ring a bell. That makes sense. We are here. Goodbye for now. Partially. Be quiet. Oh. If thou seekest wisdom, hark thou the raven.
Virtues of the Raven. Virtue 1. Resourcefulness. A raven makes a useful thing from a ruthless bit of string. Virtue 2. Community. Weak alone, but in a flock, as deadly as a slinger's rock. Virtue 3. Thrift. The broken broom we throw away will nest a raven all her days. Virtue 4. Foresight. The tremors in a half-full glass warn raven of danger yet to pass. Virtue 5. Humor. The raven's laugh remind us all, despite coin and pride, we took and fall. Virtue 6. Bravery. A wind-blown page can start her flying, but raid her nest and she's a lion. Virtue 7. Patient. Patience. A raven will for hours wait for you to leave your dinner plate. Sister Jeffrey. The reader of this book eats a root vegetable. The man, the man with the sharp blade that rings broth. Oh, thank you. Sister Dala, a happy-go-lucky dreamer. Brave, funny, and a friendly to all, but lacking all the other virtues. Sister Berga, had we need of an army, this girl would lead it. Brave, resourceful, and always thinking three steps ahead. She is more suited to Will's Van than Orkan. She is imprudent in her spending and quick to anger, however, and this has led to fights when she is mocked. Sister Elisif, ev very efficient but bossy and snappish. She has no patience or humor and sees herself above the rest of us. She thinks only for herself. Sister Aisa, a broken woman, looking for a fresh start. She is resourceful and thrifty but fears everything, including her sisters and cannot see beyond the moment. Sister Freya, everyone's friend, a great one for bringing the sisters together, a teller of jokes and a shoulder to cry on. She lacks the patience, fort tough, uh, for fort and resourcefulness to be a leader. However, otherwise I might promote her. Sister Hefa, a kind but fl flighty girl. She lacks the virtues of bravery, thrift and resourcefulness, a feather head. Sister Lovegirl, a diligent work horse but a dullard, though selfless in her dedication to the covenant and her sisters, with a patience and thrift that would be admirable in a chatelaine, she has neither the wit nor resourcefulness to lead. Sister Joffrey, but for her lack of patience and humor, this girl would be an ideal candidate for promotion. She has all the other virtues except perhaps thrift but it can be countered with a good second in command. Sister Inga, a crappy little thing, but very clever. She is resourceful, patient, thrifty, and plans ahead, but she fears the others and does not share with them. Sister Grimhold, the most forefight of my flock, but also the most defiant. She is brave, patient, resourceful, and thinks ahead, but does not feel she is a part of our family. Okay. Okay. I think you should work on oh, getting really rid of the draft. You really can get sick. Okay, we still have not seen all of this floor, I think. Ah, Dragon's Pile Bomb. Darkness, take me. Um, never. 
never lost yet. You dare on your speak mark. thus to one of the chosen. Hey. <laughs> On your word. Get out of my at your command. Yes. This world will be better off without you. I. Orders. On your word. Orders. Yep. On your word. Ready. Ready. Forgive me. Don't you have more? Hmm? There it is. Okay. We came from here. Like the mouth of the Ithrian. Oh, and deeper still. Okay, let's save. Can we enter that? Well, of course we can, and we are supposed to. Oh, that's nice. So let's eat first. <laughs> yes. Don't you just love those puzzles? Um... Now it's okay? No, it's not okay. We have more yet to light. Perhaps we have to light them all. I don't want to. Take 
Yeah. Speak, command me. Really? 